Hey guys, uh, back here again with the Cavalry Imagery Lab. Uh, this one involves our good old cheese curl. Okay, I've seen some fun experiments with some cheese curls, and we're gonna again release this chemical energy that's currently in our cheese curl. We're gonna get transferred into heat energy, which again, very kinetic. Okay, and we're going to monitor the temperature change of this water in my calorimetry device. Again, we have 50 milliliters of water in here, okay? And I took an initial temperature of 20.7 degrees Celsius. So I got my probe set up, okay, and we're gonna be able to monitor the temperature change, okay, as I convert some of this cheese curl energy, okay, from chemical to some kinetic heat energy. Okay. So get her flaming, okay. Flaming hot Cheeto, or cheesy, cheese doodle, okay. And we'll let that heat exchange from food to the can containing our water. Okay. Try to get it. Oh, transfer. Okay. Definitely not as vigorous as the Dorito was. But we're still getting some decent flame off this. Okay. Monitor the temperature difference as we go through here. I'm getting a little spot of non burnt. Try to get that thing as cooked as possible. Okay, well done, well done. Okay, make sure. Ah, phooey. We do have a little bit of an unlit area here. Let's see if we can get her going. I don't generally like to relight things like that. I just like them cooking. Okay, until we get as much consumption as possible. Okay, some decent heat exchange. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Looking at the, the screen there for the data. Okay. Oh, you're not done burning yet. Hmm. Extra crunchy. Oh, it doesn't want to stay up. There you go. Good cheese curl. Da, 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 da. Little flame still flickering. This one's hanging on. Ah, and we finally have burnout. Ah, we'll get the mass of that cr cr crunchy piece here in a moment. Okay, there's a little chunk I have to pick up off the table. So let's go ahead and read the final temperature. Okay, uh, still just slightly climbing, just a tad. One second. Mm. Looks to be holding steady now at 46.3. 46.3. Oh. 46.3 degrees Celsius. So 46.3 degrees Celsius for our final water temperature. Okay. So let's go look at that data, guys, and get crunching. 